And with a Victoria, it's Robert Whittaker. I mean, you treated us to such a fight, both of you just then. You came out on top. I know you went into this one with a dog in you. You had something to prove to yourself. Are you satisfied? Are you happy with your performance tonight? I am satisfied. Yeah. You know, and I think, I think all the fans that were in attendance and all the fans at home saw that as well. I brought the dog back out. I showed everyone the hunger in my soul and my spirit, and it's hotter than ever. <laughs> and you certainly have so much fan support, and we could see that into your eyes going into that, that you meant business. But Paolo no <laughs> you got a lot of support over here too from me and Gary. Um, did you watch Ian's fight at all? I did, I did. And I want to say... Congratulations, Ian. Top five, brother. Oh, nice, nice. But talking of positions, this gets you back towards your goal of becoming the middleweight champion once again. Is there a name at the top of the division that you feel gets you towards that title shot once again? I want to fight Drickus. Everyone yeah. knows that. Every, I've been saying it before he was the champ. I wanted to run that back because I, I feel like I have more to give than, than, than what, he, what he got. Yeah. So... That's the direction I'm heading. I'm always in the talks for title contention. I've been at the top of the food chain for years. So I'm just going to keep doing what I do. And yeah, the chips will fall. That's the fight you want. Let's just go back to the fight from tonight. And that spinning back kick at the beginning from Costa. I mean, what did you call it in the, in the cage with Joe Rogan? It was, a, uh, <laughs> it was a flesh wound. A flesh wound, but um, how much did that one hurt? <laughs> um, I think it was his, it was the best shot of the night, yeah. I think. And uh, it, it came out of nowhere. It was very hard to see. But, yeah, brush it off and it was all right. And you were really chopping up the lower leg as well. What was that? I mean, obviously you had the dog in you and that was the intention. But what was the game plan coming in and how did it play out? in the cage tonight? The game plan in my road to victory was taking the fight to him. Yeah. You know, I, he's a bully, in my opinion. He's a great fighter, yeah. and he's got really heavy strikes, but he's a bully, and if you let him do what he wants, he's gonna hurt you. So I, my whole game plan was, was turning into a dog fight, making it a war, taking the fight to him, and I had a firefight with him, and I come out on top. And you said you'd put that pressure on yourself this week, and it, it paid off. Is that the sort of mentality you think you'll take into these next fights, whether it's the rematch with Drickus next or somebody else? Do you, do you think that's that what you need now? You know, you've been there, you've been at the top of the mountain and you're looking to get back there. Do you think you need to be that hard on yourself every time? I, I, I definitely needed to kick up the ass yeah. and I had it. And uh, yeah, I'm back on the horse. How soon would you like to get back in the cage? I want to see my family. I want to see my yeah. family. Yeah. You know, I, I, I had a new baby girl this, this, this camp and uh, I want to spend some time with her. It would be well deserved as well. Five aside team now. I think you've got it home, it haven't is. you? It is. I've got a five aside. <laughs> and I know you do this for your family and um, we hope you get your wish, obviously, with Drickers. There's, there's been a, a big mix up in the middleweight division, you know, since since Izzy lost, with Drickers coming in now and taking the belt, Sean before that. Would Sean be another opponent that would might be a, an interesting matchup for you? The the division is rife with opportunity. Yeah. There are fights everywhere to be had. It's hard to lock them in, yeah. but there, there, it seems like there's fights and there's movement. I'm going to go home, heal my wounds, spend time with my yeah. family, and then knock down whoever they put in front of me. Well, well deserved. We always love watching you and seeing the best version of you come out tonight as well. Congratulations, enjoying that time off. Thank you. Thank you so much.